$5,000 carrot at the back end of that is he's able to be the best regional feature horse for the season. And I guess the other little blowout horse, I think you'd have to step up another Nacho, but certainly Clancy's Fob Watch is doing a great job at the moment, has got a terrific turn of speed. We'll just need a 9.7 out of 10 drive from uh, Zach Phillips to win the race from inside the second row. Five, four, nine, and eight. My numbers in the Cranbourne Go Gold Cup, fingers crossed. The Decron Cranbourne Gold Cup at Group 2 level is underway. They're racing. Mustang Bart came out quickly. Code Black was showing good early speed. Shadow Sax and San Carlo began well. Shadow Sax is moving forward. He just put in a rough stride shortly after the start, but in front, Mustang Bart leads over Shadow Sax. San Carlo out three wide, goes forward in a hurry. Clancy's Fob Watch on the inside of Code Black. Just behind them, Hickstead, Messini, and last of all was Let's Elope on the Decron Bender. Out in front now Shadow Sax. He took over from Mustang Bart. Without cover, San Carlo and three back the inside. Clancy's Fob Watch. One out, one back. Code Black. Trailed up by Messini. Hickstead second last. And last of all was Let's Elope. Two rounds left to travel in the Decron Cranman Gold Cup at Group 2 level. Shadow Sax in front. Leads by a neck over San Carlo. Will have to be tough. Code Black. One out, one back. And on the leader's back, Mustang Bart will wait for the mark. Going to Associates Sprint lane runner. Clancy's Fob Watch three back the inside on the inside of Messini. The Trots Country Cup Championship leaders one out and two back about eight metres behind the leader Shadow Sax. On the inside Hickstead and Let's Elope who's the only runner who contested this race last year. He's last and the best part of 12 metres behind the leader Shadow Sax. Lead time 109.2. Shadow Sax in front. He leads by a metre. San Carlo doing the work on the outside of the speed. In behind the leader Mustang Bart receiving the run of the race. Code Black, one out, one back. Messini, three back the outside. No moves mid-race. Clancy's Fob Watch, three back the marker line. Then Let's Elope and Hickstab was last of all. Into the front straight around Decron Bend once again. 29-3, first quarter of the last mile. Shadow Sacks in front. He leads by a metre. San Carlo second. Code Black on the outside of Mustang Bart. Then Clancy's Fob Watch, Messini. Let's Elope second last. Hickstab is seeing the lot of them. Past the bell, the two favourites, Shadow Sax on the inside of San Carlo. San Carlo racing a little keenly now. Co Black on the outside of Mustang Bart. Clancy's Fob Watch. He can sprint quickly. He's only six off the leader. Three back the markers on the inside of Messini. Then Let's Elope and Hickstab was last. 30 seconds was the second quarter. 59.3 for the half. Shadow Sax, a narrow leader from San Carlo. Under pressure, Mustang Bart, but sticking on. Co Black in the 1 1. No movers yet from Messini. He's on the outside of Clancy's Fob Watch, then Hickstead, and Let's Elope was last coming out of the back straight with 400 metres left to travel. Shadow Sacks in front, 26.9 down the back straight. He was motoring. He leads a metre, San Carlo on the inside, Mustang Bart, three wide, Co Black, four wide, Messini. Clancy's Fob Watch gets the run via the mark, going associate sprint lane. Shadow Sacks in front, Clancy's Fob Watch powering through, wider out, trying hard, Co Black with San Carlo. Carlo, but Shadow Sax in front. He's in marvellous form. He'll win another cup. Shadow Sax beats Clancy's Fob Watch, Mustang, Bath and San Carlo. Close up there, Co Black and Messini. Then Let's Elope and Hickstead at the tail end of the field. Last quarter, 28-7. They blazed a 55-6 last half, and the Elder Baron Park mile rate was 156.6. Shadow Sax, Emma Stewart and Chris Alfeather win another one. He's had a great season. Won the South Australian Cup. He won the Geelong and Stall Cups. And he's now added the Cranbourne Cup, the Decron Cranbourne Gold Cup to his list of achievements. Eight Clancy's Fob Watch flying through along the sprint lane into second spot in the bid of three straight wins. He's just failed but lost no admirers.